So I just went to McDonald's to buy the last version of the three series of the $10 burger. And it came in this package. Uh, it's only available in Japan. This is the third of the series, and they're probably going to sell out within hours of me videotaping this. I had the first week's one. That was very good. It was bacon and pineapple and uh, back bacon in uh, a quarter pounder. This week it's called the Ruby, and uh, let's let's open it up and see what's, what it's all about. It came in this very stylish uh, package, this bag. Let's see what else we got in here. Uh, a card. It's called the Ruby Spark. It's saying what's all in there. It's there's some uh, chorizo, chorizo, some pepper, jack cheese, beef, lettuce, avocado cream, and uh, some other things in there. Oh, grilled onions. Looks pretty good. So this is just a. <laughs> this is kind of like an unboxing of the the burger itself. What else do we have in here? Uh, and, and oh, this is probably uh, just to hold the burger, I guess. Some information about the Ruby Spark. Oh, it goes through the ingredients and how how the burger is made. There's a picture of what it's supposed to look like there. Alright. Let's take out the burger itself. My, my bad camera work here. Oh, so, this box slides open here. Sourdough bread, there's a chorizo. Ooh, lots of cheese in there. Thickness. It's pretty kind of messy, actually. It's very uh, uncharacteristic of a McDonald's in Japan, actually. And for a Tanella burger, yeah, I would say yeah, that's not quite characteristic. But I am going to chow this down nonetheless. It smells very good. All right. And just to mention, last week I went through the drive-thru and uh, it was maybe, I don't know, dinner time and they were already sold out. But, here it goes. I'm going to chow down and uh, maybe give you my reactions in the comments or whatever. Alright, that is the McDonald's $10 burger, Ruby Sapphire. <laughs> 